Hi, this is Chris at the Queen's. After a very, very busy Friday night, uh, myself, Kath and Elaine decided to just share a bottle of red wine and sit and just chat and chill out before bed. Anyway, the conversations became quite deep. Elaine was telling us all about some books she's been reading about the cruelty uh, from the Germans and Auschwitz and everything. Uh, and the story about the boy in the blue striped pyjamas. So things were quite sort of deep and morbid as we were chatting away. Um, so as you can see from this video, we just sat having a nice quiet drink. But then I want to share with you what happens with Elaine's glass. So we're chatting away. Elaine's explaining various things that she's read up about, as I say, cruelty um, in the war with regards to the Germans, how they treated people. And um, we're all sat there just enjoying a glass of wine. Now, Elaine's glass, she's um, got it sat back about four inches from the table. The table was dry, because I checked it after the event. Um, but a glass left the table not many minutes after this. Uh, I presume it's the ghost. Didn't like uh, what we were talking about. But as I say, Elaine's chatting away, telling us all this story. And unbeknown to us, none of us notice, a glass starts to move forward across the table. It's moving now. None of us notice it. It gets very, very close to the edge. In fact, at one point, it's actually balancing right on the edge. And then as she's chatting away, all of a sudden the glass tips and absolutely covers her in red wine. Let, there we go. It was just shocking. We just all sat there thinking, oh my God, how on earth did that happen? And the table was as dry as a bone. There was no wet on the table at all. So I'm presuming that's uh, the Queen's ghost, one of them playing tricks on us. Glasses leave this table all the time. Loads of customers get showered in lager and whatever. But tonight, Friday the 23rd of February, it was Elaine's turn. Okay, thank you.